Hi all folks, this is Max from um, SamsungEpicHacks.com So I've got the uh, review of the ice cream sandwich um, Sorry, I've been kind of a little bit sick So I've been a little bit behind here But um, hey uh, There's MathKid95 um, Anyway, this is the um, Android 4.0.3 CM9 for um, Epic 4G Um about phone. It's an Android 4.0.3 uh, Sign CM9. Um, this one actually works pretty well. Everything works out of the box. Uh, I really like it actually. Um, <clears throat> let me see. 4G also works, so that's that's a real plus. And also the camera works, which is a nice thing. And then we'll take a photo here. Of um oh this is a camcorder so camcorder works and uh, there's a slight of a lag when you press the start button and stop button wait but the camera is actually pretty good let me show you so the camera is working. Um, 4G is working, and uh, I did run a quadrant test. I got about a thousand. Um, it's it's a pretty good ROM. And by the way, I'm using my new Canyon. Well, not new, but sort of new. The 300 HS. Um, I'm a on my lounge chair. This is kind of cool. Actually, the resolution is pretty good. If I put it on macro mode, you can see. Um, let me show you. The browser is very smooth. Um, it's a very usable ROM, even though this is like an alpha version. Um, but everything is pretty much working. Wi-Fi is working. Bluetooth is working. Um, just a slightly laggy, but um, this one doesn't have. Uh, let me see here. No. No Wi-Fi. Uh, no overclocking. But you can go to performance. Okay. Um, processor and I've got it set it at interactive X and maximum frequency is only one gig but I think um, in the future we should have a uh, overclockable kernels and maybe if you can run it at 1.2 or 1.4 gigahertz overclocked it should run much smoother but I mean just by itself it's actually pretty smooth other than that it's a full ICS experience you can get um, let me check the uh, let me check if there's face unlock real quick. Is there a face unlock? Oh, there isn't face unlock. So let me set it up real quick. Here. Uh oh, there we go. Well, it's the lighting's kind of off. Uh, you can try it yourself. But uh, actually, let me do it real quick. I'll be right back. So I got it set up, but it seems like it's not working that well. I think it's because the processor is way too slow. Um, with overclock, face unlock should work much better. Um, let me see if there's any other features I can show you. Let's see home. Let me see. Um, other than that, it's you know it's a pretty complete ROM. It can be your daily driver. There's a slight of lag, but um. Definitely, it's not going to be slower than the Froyo or, you know, maybe just a tad slower than Gingerbread Overclock. Um, but check it out. You just got to zip the two files, um, the CM9 zip file, and then after it reboots, you can get back into um, Clockwork Mod Recovery, holding down the power button, reboot, and then you can choose Recovery to reboot into Recovery and flash the G apps, the Google apps file, and you should be all ready to go. But um, this is actually uh, looks a lot better than the um, the CM9 ICS ROM I reviewed on Epic 4G Touch, which is surprising because this is an older OG phone, um, O Gangster. Anyway, check it out. Um, that was a review of the CM9 ICS ROM for um, Epic 4G. Yeah. Oh yeah. And subscribe.
and see y'all later.